Hey guys, Edog Plays here, bringing you guys another video. Today we're hopping back on Merge Plans for part 25. We've been doing these episodes so quickly, like I can't believe we're on episode 25 already. But as you guys can see, we're already, well, we just earned 111. So someone commented, it's million, it's not billion, but 111,000 million doesn't really sound right. So I'm just going to call it 111 billion. Um... I think that's correct. I'm not too sure, honestly, but whatever. $111 billion while we were away. Um, let's go ahead and collect that. So that is the most amount of money that we've made offline, which obviously makes sense. You should be earning more and more every single episode, you, every episode we make. Um, so that's actually pretty good. $111 million. I think yesterday was our first ever episode of actually hitting over $100, $100 billion. Uh, what did we have? We had like 107 or something like that. So we increased a little bit, obviously not a lot. But if we do get the level 22 plane today, we will be way, way higher. But don't think we're going to be able to do that because we need to get two level 19s. So we are still a little ways away from that. But hopefully in the next couple episodes, that would be great. But right off the bat, let's watch a video to receive a 15 plane. And Oh, I thought I wasn't even going to make us watch the video, but... Honestly, we need to watch these videos. I know I say it basically every single episode, but we need to watch these videos or else we're just not going to be progressing fast enough. Especially like when we didn't earn offline income the one episode. Like that was so difficult to actually progress because we had no starting money to do anything. We couldn't start off and buy a level 16 plane or anything like that. We had to basically watch a bunch of videos, try to earn as much money as we could, but it was actually really difficult to get going. Same with not watching these videos. Like, we would have to buy all the plans, and that'd be extremely, extremely difficult. So we got a level 15. That's not bad. Let's merge all these. We have so many little, little planes, and it's good, but it's also bad at the same time. Ooh, we can actually combine a lot. There we go. We have our first, well, another 19-level plane. We don't have any more, so we do need to get one more still before we can get the 22nd plane which will be sick super super excited for that hopefully we can do that really really soon uh, once we get one more level 10 plane we'll be able to get a level 14 which isn't bad uh, merge counts reach five at fifty thousand dollars which is basically little basically nothing <coughs> sorry basically nothing if we go here though we can buy uh one level 17 plane uh, which would actually it'd get us pretty far. I'm not gonna lie. That wouldn't be too bad uh, Let's see what we can do here. There we go. We got a level 14 plane if we buy one more level 14, which is 8 billion Yeah, we can actually buy this and that still okay So we just got that there we go merge those to make a level 15 there we go So we have well that actually should go right there There we go. So we have a 21 a 20 19 no 18 and a 17 so we just need two more 18s now and uh, then we'll have the brand new plane. Like I said, I don't think we're going to be able to get it this episode. But, I mean, hopefully hopefully we'll get pretty close. Uh, we can buy level 17 planes. So, at least next episode we'll be able to make one level 18 plane. Um, if we were to just, like, end the episode right now. So, that's actually not too bad. I, we, I don't think we're going to be able to get it next episode. But, for sure, the episode after. Because we two level 18 planes are pretty pretty difficult to get. I mean, you can't even buy them. You need gems. But, I mean, we are really close. So, after today's episode, we'll be one gem away from earning the level 18 plane. And I think that might be what we need to do is buy one. Um, I know I said I probably wasn't going to spend my gems on it because it's a little ridiculous. But, I mean, now we're getting to the point where getting a level 18 or 19 level plane is extremely difficult. You can't do it in one episode. So... Spending gems that we've been saving up for quite a while now, I believe since we got this level 21 plane, um, we might have to do. But, I mean, it, it kind of makes up for it because now it is taking a lot longer to get new planes. And the gems are obviously coming at the same amount, so we're kind of being able to buy a new plane with gems around like once every new plane we get so once we get the level 22 plane we're basically gonna have no gems and then once we are close to get upgrading to level 23 we'll be able to buy a plane with gems that's kind of how it's going because obviously it's taking longer and longer per plane per new plane we get so they gotta kind of make it harder to get gems because if they, if they didn't if they made it easier to get gems then you'd just be able to buy a bunch of level 18 planes like one an episode that wouldn't make it very challenging 
So I kind of understand now why they're doing it. We do not want to buy gems. A hundred dollars. This is probably U.S. as well. Hundred dollars for five thousand seven hundred gems. That's a lot of gems. Obviously, you could buy a ton of planes, but for a hundred bucks, and for me, it's probably like a hundred and thirty dollars. Ridiculous. But plus ninety percent, I guess that doesn't really make me want it anymore. But uh, ninety-nine cents for thirty gems. That's. I guess it kind of all depends where you're at in the game. If you're like at the very beginning, that's actually a pretty good deal, I guess. But for me, I'd have to buy two of those, so it's gonna cost me two dollars to get a new plane. So it's like uh, that wouldn't really be worth it for someone that's a little bit further into the game compared to someone is like just starting. Obviously, that uh, makes sense. But interesting, interesting the prices. I thought it would probably be a little bit cheaper. But I guess, I guess maybe not. Let's watch a video to get two times speed. Hopefully we're going to get two minutes and 30 seconds uh, boost. Two times speed boost. I believe last episode we had like $57 million per second. Could have been a little bit lower, but I'm not too sure. And we completely forgot to spend the exchange, the currency, which is now going to bump it up to airlines earning us 70% more, I believe. So we'll be able, we want to do a comparison from before we buy it to after we buy it to see how much more we're actually making. Obviously 70%, but how much is that? Is, it, is that going to be an extra 10 million per second? Uh, I, we're going to find out, I guess, right after this ad. But we're also going to be earning two times income. So that's obviously going to be a little difficult to compare. We probably shouldn't have activated it yet. Because uh, I don't think we can, like, save for later, obviously. Well, you're not going to be able to. So we have 2 minutes and 30. Ooh, did I just click that? Please tell me I didn't add another. Okay, I didn't. I thought I added more time for gems. I really, really didn't want to do that. Uh, okay, so, well, let's try to wear this off a little bit before we buy that. I know we're kind of wasting money, but I want to do, a co like, a normal comparison without speed boost or anything. Just how much we're we making without the 70% and then 70% what does that actually give us 10 million more uh, 5 million more 7 million more I'm assuming I mean we're earning like 25 million so it probably give us like 5 to 7 million more uh, per second obviously so we'll, we'll see though we will see we can merge those two there we go now we have a level 16 plane as well uh, so we have a 21, 20, 19, 17, 16. We can probably almost buy level 16. Uh, yeah, seven, 7 billion away from level another level 16 plane, which should get us one level 18 plane, which then next episode we'll be able to purchase the, the plane for gems. So we will for sure get it next episode if we can get another six million or $6 billion this episode, which we should be able to do. So guys, get excited for next episode. We're going to be getting the 23rd plane, which is going to be insane. It's going to be absolutely dope. I'm super, super excited. So $62 million per second. That's not bad. That's really, really nice. Um, I Talking about like the billion, million, whatever. Let me know down below in the comments if you guys actually want me to start calling it uh, 33,000 million. Seems really, really long, but if you guys want me to call it that, I mean, I can call it that. Um, I just found 33 billion more, or easier to say. I don't know if it's actually 33 billion, um, but that's what I'm going to call it. Because it just sounds really, really weird. 34,000 million um, sounds a little weird. But uh, our speed boost is at 25 seconds left, and we're at 13.4 million uh, exchange currency whatever so we're actually going to be getting like I said before airline earnings increase by 70% so it's gonna be a huge 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 jump up um, hopefully earning us a ton more money uh, but yeah like I said I just want to wait for this speed boost to end five seconds left just so we can get a clear clean comparison between what we had and what we now are gonna have there we go so 31.3 million dollars uh, I mean let's merge a couple more 31.4 million dollars a second 38 so 7 million dollar increase per second which is actually really really nice i didn't think it was going to be that high i kind of thought it was going to be more towards a six i guess it was kind of like a 6.3 because we were at 31.4 now we're at 38.1 so it's more of a 6.3 um yeah 6.3 right 
I no 6.7 sorry 6.7 I believe whatever 6.7 between 6 and 7 million increase really really nice obviously it's going to be different for everyone if you guys are making 40 million dollars a second it's going to be 70 percent increase of 40 million so it's going to be a lot more um but it's a pretty good upgrade i mean for just like i don't want to go out of my way every time i start a new episode spending all my offline earnings on that i wouldn't want to do that that wouldn't really seem worth it to me uh i would like for the next ones i'm gonna keep doing it what i'm doing um after the end of the episode just spend whatever we have left over on the exchange because usually if we have like three billion dollars left over we come on the next episode with 110 like we did now it's not really worth it to keep the three billion dollars and i don't want to obviously spend the 110 on the currency exchange so i find that this is kind of the best way to do it if you guys have any other suggestions leave them down below in the comments but this gold membership i've been kind of thinking about uh possibly doing it it's really really expensive though three or five bucks probably us every single week let me know if you guys any of you guys actually have this and if it's worth it uh we could probably we could do a start for free but you need to kind of accept it and it will start charging your credit card and it probably won't even tell you that it charged your credit card unless you go and look but uh, i don't know if that's something if you, that's something you guys want to see so i can kind of do like an analysis on it compare see if it's actually worth it if any of you guys are wondering I, I can do that for sure i can try the trial even do a one week well the week plus the three days so we'll get 10 days of actually trying it so that's actually going to earn us in 10 days 100 gems well actually more than that if we come on every day because of course we're getting the five gems every day we come on or the challenge that we have to do every day which is super super easy to do so we'll actually be getting 15 gems every single day if you think about it and if you're actually doing the challenges which are super easy so you should be able to do 15 gems a day which after 10 days even after a week uh would start to add up seven gem well seven days in a week obviously at 15 gems i don't know what that is but um that would actually be quite a bit and maybe even worth it kind of want to take a look and what we're actually getting though we're getting two more parking spaces yeah i guess that's kind of okay uh plus 150 speed which i think would be absolutely sick that would definitely be something that i would want that's probably the best thing off 120 percent offline earnings is sick as well uh, plus two more fairways, uh, kind of, remove ads in shop, that would be super nice, and 10 gems every day. You know what guys, next episode, when you see this, I'm gonna have this membership, uh, I'm purchasing it for you guys, so if you guys, I'll do a video showing you guys if it's worth it, if it's not. smash like button and subscribe so you guys don't miss any more daily content i will see you guys in